Hey, hey, Spring Lafay, Simple Tarot. Okay, um, as you probably realize by now, I haven't been posting anything lately. I've been sick a lot, so I have plenty of messages, though. I have been feeling them. Um, they have stayed at bay um, because I had to get to feeling better. Yeah, so first out, though, um, I've been feeling it was coming, and that is going to be for... Um, the sign of Leo and uh, yeah it's been a strong one so we're just gonna see what we get Special message for the sign of Leo. Queen of Wands reversed. Somehow this person doesn't want to deal with you or doesn't want to deal with anyone. This energy does not feel good. Doesn't want to work with anyone. Whoever this is. Okay. This person, they don't want to work with someone. Oh my goodness. Okay. This is someone that, um, This is something that's destined to come forward. It's, it's something to, that's destined to happen. It, it, it's supposed to happen. But how you handle it is going to, it feels like, really be a game changer. Some, it's going to change something. Um, you got temperance here. That's where I'm really getting the destined feel from this, the faded feel that this is something that just, it, it's like it has to happen. It just needs to happen. Now, this person, it feels like it's coming quickly towards you. They are not in a good light. They're not in a very giving way. They're, you know, queen of wands, life of the party, you know, a really um, giving person, grow anything. This person's the opposite. This person is not in a good way. They're not in a giving way. Okay, tell me more. Let's see. And then with us having that temperance there, you know, like I said, a lot of what I'm getting from that is fate and destiny and, um, you know, it's kind of like, a, I'm going to be honest with you, there's a bit of caution too. Um, I feel like the caution has got something to do with how you react to this. You know, I'm also getting the word compassion, so... It's kind of like, are you going to have compassion for this person? How are you going to, you know, react to whatever this is that's coming towards you? It's that type of feeling. Queen of Wands reversed. Queen of Wands reversed. Someone who's having trouble making decisions, having trouble deciding what to do, what to do, what they need to do. Um... Okay, this is someone that they're having trouble because it's like, whew, either it feels like they walked away. They walked away. It's like they walked away. They moved away from, it feels like, a family or a home or their life of some sort with someone. They feel like um, th this has got, could be a soulmate. It could be... Um, Someone who they felt like was a soulmate. And it's like, you know, with the, the high priestess here, it's a feeling like this person, I'll be honest with you, see, they're having trouble making decisions because they're having trouble really seeing what they need to see about this, seeing what to do. Uh, this feels like this was a relationship that went awry for someone. Um, so, Leo, you're going to have to take this how 
you're getting this because this is someone who wants to come back towards you now um, for some of you this person could have been gone for some of you this person could still be there with you and it's just going awry things are going wrong and they've like kind of tapped out whenever I say walked away you know what I'm getting um, is it doesn't have to be actually walking away actually leaving with the chariot it could be tapped out I'm done and they just kind of close off that type of feeling so for some of you it's like that you could still be with this person for some of you this person has actually left they have actually gone away and it's like you know trying to make decisions they're they're not they need to bring balance to themselves they're they're totally out of balance uh, they're not in a good light. They're not, you know, whew. yeah. Three of Cups. Okay, whoever this is, you know, like I said, they want to bring things back together. Um, the Knight of Pentacles. I'm going to be honest with you, though. I feel like this person is going to have a hard time saying they're sorry. Because to me, it's a feeling like they feel like they've done everything right and they're dwelling on it. It's like they feel like you've done whatever, you know, you've done something wrong towards this relationship and they are totally dwelling on it. You know, at one point in time, this was a happy, happy, that, that is the yes card, if you had a yes and no way, uh, question. But there's, this was a happy relationship that was balanced. You know, it's like it was balanced. There may have been children involved. It's like things were flowing. Things were going. Um, maybe even been, someone may have even had animals and they were involved. And it's like something just happened. Something went awry. Something changed the whole thing. And now someone's dynamic has just really changed their um, it feels like they're not the same person they may have been at one time, you know, and it's like they're thinking about, they're thinking about when things seemed like they were good with the Ace of Pentacles, when things seemed happy, when things seemed balanced, when things seemed like they were moving forward, and you know, it's like, for this person, this is a type of sadness, because it feels like this could be a sadness for this relationship, for some of you this was a marriage, and it feels like it could be ending. I'm just saying. Now, for some of you, you know, oh, this could be saved. It could be poured back together. It's all in how you look at things, and it's all in how you go forward, you know, together. You know, do you, um, you know, with the star card being here, I feel like there's a need to look at flaws. And I'm not talking about just flaws of one person. I'm talking about flaws within a relationship. There's a need to um, bring the light on what needs to be light shed upon to help to heal whatever this is within this relationship. Um, it, it feels like that someone, someone's been very foolish and they may have jumped ship as far as emotions are concerned before they should have with the full card and it's time to really heal things it's time to see if this can be you know really fixed and healed and if it you know if it needs to end then it feels like that you know with the hermit being here it, it can be going down a path that's meant for you so I'm just saying um, you know and that comes down to decisions choices you know what's right for you what do you need to do it's that type of feeling oh my goodness this is a very um whew, i don't know what the word is I, I had the word tenacious come to me oh my goodness reading so mercy me hmm. okay wow leo you got dealing with something here that's very emotional and very um okay see emperor justice death for some of you this will end with this person because 
it's like you know what you're worth you know your value you know that you've got you and you it feels like you've moved away from this for some of you um justice is here because you know things have to be balanced in the end things need to be dealt with they need to be you know you need to be happy you don't need to stay in something that's not happy um just because i mean that's the way i look at it death cards here because it will be ending for someone uh, now i don't feel like that's for all of you i really really don't i don't feel like it's going to be an ending for all i feel like there's there's a few that this is going to pull back together it's almost like there's a, a sense of strength that's going to be um can i have the other card May I have the other card? Oh my goodness, it's too many. See, it's a feeling like there's a sense of strength that's going to come through. Someone's going to do the right thing. They're going to do what they need to do and make the decision, seeing things clearly, that, you know, really stepping back and looking at everything. And I feel like both people need to do that. And they, they can pull this together. They can pull it together because for some of you, this is a relationship that doesn't need to end. It needs to go forward. Um, for some of you, it's a marriage. For some of you, you've been together quite some time. For some of you, you don't have to have been together a long time. There's such a bond there. It just seems like a, such a waste to let it just go. And that is what I have for you. Um, so, yeah. If you like the content that I do put out, please do subscribe. Hit that little bell. That will notify you every time I upload. Give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for being with me. Bye.